people are at the juncture where you that everything from America to Japan shifted to Korea. In 70s, Korea was the one which was in a lower level of employment. I may not be able to tell anything great, but then website will tell you www.sangrej.com Anyone else? Want to come down here? Anyone from the girls? Yes, anybody? Maybe you have doubts, you want to train persons, send them to Dr. Subramaniam. I will give you the answer. Are we done? Are you here for the placements? Huh? You want to interact with the people, but nobody is asking any question here. You don't have questions. If you don't ask questions, any general don't question. get up. You know, don't be insulted coming here. If you are not coming here, you are losing an opportunity. Even if the most idiotic person come here, you are recognized. First, first step, you are recognized by over 50, 60 people. Don't lose that opportunity. Your lecturers are sitting here, your teachers are sitting here. Come down, stand here and ask. You are instantly recognized. Don't leave that opportunity. It's an opportunity. If you are leaving an opportunity just because you feel shy, then that's the most difficult thing. You can say, I'm not jumping and waste it. Please come. Please come. Yeah, he is asking what was your driving force? Motivation. See, many people have asked. Many people have asked. In 1998, when no one was talking about solar, how was your such a great visionary to start about that at that time? I am not aware. I was in that industry. Then the opportunity was with India and China. India could not represent themselves properly, so it went to China. China being a huge country, it took them 30 years. From 80s to 2020s. Now China is also the opportunity for people is India, Vietnam, Philippines. And some people are talking about Brazil also. Then I don't know which, how can they sustain. If it comes to India, then your generation is going to make a fortune out of it. Your generation is going to make a fortune out of it because it will sustain for 30 years. When you are entering into your career, things are going to start when it will provide you such an opportunity to grow. You know, when you are talking about mobile industry, you may be dominated by China mobile. It was started somewhere on the way you want to go, mother went to come. You know, people have grown. You know, that opportunity is knocking down at our country. If everything goes well, then you will be riding that time. Be prepared. Wherever you are, whatever you are, whichever field of industry you are, you get an opportunity. Be prepared, work towards it, learn more about it, and then be prepared to ride that time. Don't disheartened that you are not in the software, don't disheartened that you are in this field of thing. Every field is going to grow. Only thing is, how much you can grow out of in that field depends on how much of hard work you put, in the bana and the financial decisions you How much you can judge on the loss and gain. Keep in mind these things and then try, try out being an entrepreneur. It's a great thing. You will capitalize it.
you will go for that and go to the X chance of cause of the death. You will always be the CEO, director, chairman, or chairman and editors. Sarpala and chairman and editors are the final for permanent and J.R.D. Tata Lab. They are putting my boss. So, think of this. Thank you for listening to me patiently. I am not that a great subject person like your professors. So then we have to share something which I know. And then now, if anything we ask questions or any doubts or clarifications, so forth. You can interact. If you ever get out of play then you play a cinema bound on it. If you ever get out of play, you play a cinema bound on it. If you ever get out of play, you play a cinema bound on it. So, मेरा तो आपको जब तक ना बैठे सिंबा बाहुम दल बैठे ये भी ये रहता हाँ बार में तो बिना कहीं बचा मेरी doubts you you have I'm not saying any doubts related to this because I spoke about electrical reasons you may have doubts because I spoke about something else you may have doubts so it's open to you I think I've not taken much anybody अड़ा गड़ा है कि मोहम्मद पढ़ी पे अवकाश मोली में तो if you don't ask, you will always remain that idiot. That person is never answered. If you have a doubt, ask. If you have a doubt, ask. Whether it is in class, whether it is anywhere. If you ask a doubt, people will think or call you idiot only for that moment. But then if you don't ask a doubt, you will be in need forever. Ask your doubts. Asking makes you perfect. You also know you may not be a good person. But then, when you keep talking, that will improve. And the idiot person is not going to be able to get out of the way. That will remove your state fear. That will improve your vocabulary. That will improve your communication skill. Right? All of your ideas? I think they have not framed the person. I'm so okay. So frame the person and ask. You just stand here. You ask. You just stand here. 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 You Mr. Pala Bhuman, sir, for spending his uh, really valuable time because he's an entrepreneur, he's holding his own business. Really, he spent his time, valuable time here to allay to the students. And uh, it is a need of the hour. But really, it's a great motivation session. Good opportunity for the party engineers to listen to his lecture as well as to interact with him. Even if you want to meet him personally, he may not give you the sufficient time. So it is a better opportunity for you people. When people are coming here, you feel that whether you attend or not, whether you listen to this or not. But when you go out, when you leave the gate of our college, it is very difficult to find their apartment also. So that you should understand properly. When you are arranging such lectures, it is a great uh, discussion and a time and arrangements you will make it. But you people don't feel that for when something is available. He said that everything is not a cake walk. What is it, Mr. Pratini? What is it, Mr. Kaur? So when it is uh, becoming a cake walk, so people will feel that uh, it is very simple. Okay. So I want to highlight some points in the lecture and the session. He enlightened the students with the clarity on career and jobs. He motivated the audience to do things differently to succeed in life. He educated the students with his lifetime experiences and given guidance to trigger their mindset. And he caught the students' attention which could, uh, with good number of illustrations from present life, Puranas and Itihasas. And he narrated the steps in detail to grow up in the ladder he explicitly covered the stages an engineer and entrepreneur encountered in growth and he 
detailedly explain the relation between technical, commercial, financial, legal stages with the lower, middle, upper and top level positions and uh, he explained in detail the age-wise planning of career challenges to an entrepreneur. He concluded the opportunities, finally he concluded the session, the opportunities for the heritage engineers in future when people are facing problems with the software industry what are the opportunities available, especially in the electrical engineering uh, field. So finally, he said, you should have good number of weapons so that you can face anything in your life. So it is very important. You may not realize the point at this tender age, like 20, 21, like that. And you cross the 20 or 30. He said that when responsibilities are shouldering, when more responsibilities are there, you cannot take the risk. So you should take the risk at the right time and should settle in the life whatever the things you understood during the, your lifetime experiences. And as he said, definitely out of this crowd, 2 to 3 percent will definitely will take these points to their mind and they will replace these things in their life. Thank you very much, sir. And uh, we thank once again the IEC and management for this opportunity. Thank you, sir.